Yo, what is going on guys? It's Sam here and today I'm bringing you a new video. Today we're not going to be working on the E46 wrap. I'm taking a break from wrap. Actually, the wrap, the one that messed up on the other side, actually it's already here. It's behind me. But today we're going to be installing the first mod on Thomas 335i. Um, he already installed a few mods, but they were like small cosmetic mods like the grills. So I'll show you all that in a second. But um, I want to show you something about my car too. Someone busted my rear window and it was just crazy i already got the window but i'm about to go might replace this in this video so the video can be a little longer since y'all always ask for longer videos but let's take out the e46 and pull in thomas 335 the car's actually very filthy with all this pollen um it looks really good on this side the wrap is holding pretty good but you already know this side i need to do the whole panel and this door i'm gonna go ahead and start working on the bumpers like after this video but here's the the extra wrap i had to order and I already had the bumpers pre-cut, but let's go ahead and take this car out. Look, they busted this window. You can see the little glass in here, look. Shout out to the hater. Y'all just motivate me more to work on my car. It was starting to look so good on this side. They had to get on this side. I think they did it on purpose. They busted that window because this um, side looks super good. Um, the bumper looks like the color. Um, can't wait to start wrapping the bumpers. Let's go ahead and move with Thomas BMW. All right, guys. We're here to go, Thomas 335i. Uh, Thomas, you want to say what you have done so far? A little bit, small mods, not too much. Uh, I definitely had to order the grills, that grills. Like, I make the car look different. I got vinyl. The little, the little vinyl wrap. With you. Um, and today's also a cosmetic mod. Thomas actually want to do a lot of performance mods, but um, he has to get all the little small cosmetics mod that is wrong with this car, which. When, if y'all saw the video when we first bought it, y'all know the tail lights are broken. So he bought some new tail lights and I think it's gonna look good. What's the next mod? Down pipes? Down pipes. Um, yeah, so stay tuned. We are gonna do a lot of performance mod, but like I said, Thomas wanted to get the small little uh, cosmetics mod that he can just like make the BMW look a little bit better. And those tail lights actually looks, makes your 335i looks way newer from the back foot. Let's go ahead and see the tail lights. Okay, this is the reason we're not doing performance mod first. That's because look at this tail light. It's already broken. Water gets inside here. And this tail light works, but that tail light don't work. So we might as well just like, man, replace all these tail lights and it'll look newer, clean, and then we can focus on the performance mod. Because you can't be fast with a cracked out tail light. This might fly off if you're speeding down the road or something. But uh, let's take a look at the new tail lights. All right, guys, so here go the tail lights. Um, I think they like the M3 style tail lights. Like, I don't know, it supposedly has a lot of LEDs in it, so uh, show the camera, Thomas. Wow. Yeah, that looks way better than this ugly tail lights. Yeah, you can tell a difference, plus we won't have this ugly crack and that tail light don't work. We know we can just replace the bulbs, but might as well just upgrade the tail lights. So we wanna give you a good view of how these tail lights look. They're not actually that bad, but I'm sure Thomas' new tail lights is gonna make it look much much better and much newer like the 2011 and up models so what thomas is doing right now he's just taking the three bolts on the tail lights it's pretty easy simple that's why we're not doing like a diy video because who doesn't know how to install tail lights look it's already actually moving just one last bolt right thomas yeah and we got to disconnect all the harnesses and we good all right so thomas i got the tail light now all he got to do is disconnect the harnesses all right pretty easy Show them why you replaced it. Uh, look at this. Water was getting in there, right? Yeah. And that was giving you a like a cold and a dash because of the tail light. Nah, I don't throw that. <laughs> <laughs> just saying. Thomas is known to just throwing the old parts, but just keep that in case. Yeah. Um, you might want to clean this up a little bit, Thomas. Okay. Ah oh, man. Well, just put the tail light, the new tail light on, and see how it looks for it right now. While um, Thomas is cleaning that, I'm going to give the chance to tell y'all that I'm going to try to finish the wrap this weekend. I've been so busy this week. That's why I didn't upload this week. Um, I was rebuilding my girlfriend Honda. I'm going to show pictures in the screen how it was and all the process. You know, I had to cut the um, radiator support 
um, frame out, weld the new one, uh, put the radiator support, a new star, a new alternator. We, I did all that with my girlfriend's dad, and they came out pretty good. The car runs good now. There's no like there's small little gaps here and there, but it ain't nothing noticeable. Once you give it a good paint job on the new Honda Civic, everything will be gone. But um, if y'all if y'all want to see like more videos other than BMWs, let me know the comment down below if or if I should just stick to BMWs. Whatever y'all guys want, that's what I'll upload. Ooh, wow, wow, that's a nice tail light. It's a very clean tail light. Um. Okay, guys, we forgot to show in the video. It comes with this harnesses. Uh, we, it has double side on the other side. We already took this one out. Um. It's pretty, it's down there somewhere where you can't really see it and now we just connected this and this connect to the tail lights and it should be good and just put the three bolts back on and it's on. Okay guys, we got the first tail light on. Thomas, close the trunk to see how it looks, the difference. We still haven't put this other um, like backup light or whatever that light is for um, on but this is the, this is the only thing we played so far. So this is the tail light right here and that's the old tail light. Boom, you can tell a whole difference already. And we just changed one side. Um, let's go ahead and change the reverse lights and then this tail light and let's see how it looks. Guys, this is the moment of truth. See if they turn on. Ooh, I see some LEDs flashing. Turn left, Thomas. There we go. Right. Hey, look at those taillights. They look super nice. Make the car look way newer. We still gotta put the reverse lights back on, but even with that, it looks super nice. Yep, everything's working. Comment down below if you think these lights are badass. I think it makes the e, the I about to say E46, the 335 I look way newer. Looks aggressive as fuck. So how are you enjoying the 335 so far? I'm enjoying. It. I just can't wait to go faster, man. Yeah, I, I bet. I can't wait to get mine. Um, you gonna do exhaust next or downpipes or I'm what? Downpipes. And then probably in like straight pipe exhaust, right? Or something, something to make this um car sounds a little bit louder. Cause it sounds pretty stock. So you already got it out. Yeah, you got the wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> Can you spot the different guys? We got this whole tail light on. Now we just gotta change that reverse light. We're not really showing much because anybody can. There you go. <laughs> anybody can um, change tail lights, but comment down below how's the 335i coming along, guys. I know it's just a simple tail light mod, but it does a huge difference and it repaired that broken tail light. There go the tail lights. Hell yeah, it looks it super. It looks mean from the back. Yeah, it looks more aggressive, looks more new. Maybe a carbon fiber um, little CSL trunk uh, will look good. But first you gotta get some performance mod. Tail lights is going pretty good. Feel my thing, it look like, but in my opinion, it look way different. Yeah, that nah. That, Maybe that, in person look way better. That, there's no way that looks like, you can tell the difference. That's, these tail lights look super clean. Uh, makes your car looks more aggressive. Uh, Hell yeah, that looks clean. We're probably gonna show you more of the tail lights tonight. That way we can see all the LEDs. It's kind of bright out today. Uh, meanwhile, while we wait for it to get night, I'm gonna back up my car and put my window out on and show you guys that a little bit. So the video won't be too short, but looking clean. Now we just gotta put this back on the trunk and it's an easy install. Alright guys, we just got back home. Uh, Thomas, how you like your taillights? I like them. Hey bro, I, I, I think they look pretty nice. Um, hope y'all guys enjoy those cinematics. You know, uh, Thomas did a little pull at the end, but comment down below if you like the new taillights. And yes guys, I know we might get hate because we did a cosmetic mod first, but 
trust me, Thomas got a lot of performance mod coming next. Um, so next video on the 335 hour will surely be performance. But with that being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, even though it wasn't a long video. But comment down below what you think about the taillights. And stay tuned for the next video because we are wrapping the E46 bumpers. And I already got the front bumper wrapped and it's in front of me. But y'all going to have to wait on that on that until the next video. But yeah, guys, um, if you're new to the channel, more, more performance mod coming on 335i. So stay tuned and subscribe if you're new. But as always, it's been Cervantes Garage. Stay humble, stay blessed. We out. Peace. Golf boy.